Honestly, I just want to talk about parenting for a second with you. Uh, and not even okay. from the Caleb Williams perspective as much as the Tommy DeVito Good. perspective. Can we talk about Tommy DeVito for a second? So Tommy I know DeVito. the Cowboys. I know the Cowboys crushed the Giants yesterday. This just in Giants are terrible. The Cowboys beat up on bad teams 89 to 17. Nobody remember this, but I am so fascinated on the heels of Caleb Williams display of emotion with his mother. I am so fascinated by this Tommy DeVito story. This New Jersey kid this undrafted free agent who's been thrust into action for the Giants. My guy lives with his parents. He lives yeah. with mom and dad. Mom makes his bed. See that see, there's, there's a there's a there's a there's a difference. There's a line. There's a line like the living with Come mom's part and living with yeah, mom yeah. and dad part. I cool. respect it. I respect make your it. damn I bed. Shit, I ain't making your bed. I, that's the only part get, like the making yeah, the yeah, bed yeah, part yeah, or even bed. the washing the clothes part. You got to do stop, something because honestly, I just want to talk to you Michael about how you're doing because I'm having this issue. My oldest daughter got senioritis and when I tell you man, I don't know if it's something that I did but like she treats this place like a bed and breakfast. She just be coming and going. <laughs> <laughs> she just be coming and going. <laughs> and it's just like, yo, like we don't Hold work on. for you. Yeah, yeah, like, that's right. You go, you you, you go do something around this house. It's like, it, but she don't pay rent, and yet, I, it's like we just I, like I feel like I'm failing it as a parent. And so I heard Tommy DeVito talk about his mom still making his bed, and 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 washing his clothes, and, and he ain't got to worry about cooking or nothing like that. I'm like, well, a, I get it because I tell my children all the time, you will wish you were back in this house because I know and I know I speak for you too. For as frustrated as we were as 17, 18 year olds, we could we wish we can go back to the days we weren't paying no bills. Number one. That's right. But number two, right. what is the line between you could stay here, but you got to earn your keep in some way, shape, or form? Like, like either everybody on this roof will get a job, or you're gonna be ironing, washing, cooking, cleaning do something. something. Yeah, but do just something. like yeah, do something. Because I'm trying to yeah. Like, yeah. That's the part yeah, I kind of yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, because Tommy, I'm trying to help you out. Undrafted. I like, you know, that's important part, that's an important detail. Undrafted free agent. So look, you, you didn't you didn't come in with like this guaranteed three, four year deal. Uh, and we know we gotta, you know, help you out. We're trying to help you save some money, get your own place. I got it. But hey, if I'm doing your laundry, I'm making you like the chicken cutlets, okay? Uh, I'm making you I'm making your bed. What are you contributing? What are you doing? You got to do something around the house. Mike, the other day, I, I swear to you, I did this. Only said, what are you doing? Because we're out uh, at a store and I picked up some gloves. A and they really said on there, on the tag, they said, shoveling gloves. I picked, I picked some up. <laughs> he said, well, why are you, oh, you need some gloves? I said, no, I don't. I, I don't. <laughs> I, don't mm -hmm. I don't need them. I'm just going to make sure that they're there in the house because when the first snow comes, um, I'm, I'm going to look at my kids and say, yeah, uh, whoever doesn't have gloves, there's an extra pair of gloves over there. Grab a grab a shovel and go out and shovel. So Robinson because, and Beckham, you know, they shovel snow? Do they shovel snow? Oh, oh, oh well, well, no, they don't. No, they, it's funny you say that because no, they don't. No, they don't. Mine, uh, last I time, think that might be the problem. Last time, yeah, last time I was outside, uh, this is uh, last winter, I'm shoveling. So shoveling a path in the driveway who comes out my daughter the youngest I like hey, 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 let me help you out So my daughter comes out and she's shoveling. I'm like, oh your brother. Where are your brothers? Oh, they're, they're where are they? Can you find them? Oh, they're inside? What are you doing? I think they might be waving out the window. No, you better come out here. You better come out here and help us shovel. So look if you're gonna be in the house, you gotta contribute something. If you're not ready so to wait contribute, a your your boys don't shovel. I thought that was just so okay. So okay, like let's go just, be great somewhere I, I else. Think, so my, Mason doesn't shovel. Go be great. Has never shoveled. Uh, well, actually, they shoveled when they were younger. But now I got somebody. I got a plow person. I think that's the problem. Got to plow. We didn't give it. You got to plow. We didn't give these children too much. Got a plow. I got a landscaper. Got a plow person. I used to cut the grass with scissors. Man, I used to, no, I'm joking. I know yep. I cut the grass with scissors, but you know, the, but I but I was I was mean with that lawnmower and that weed whacker back in the day, and I yep. couldn't do nothing right. on Saturdays unless and until I cut the grass and Get cleaned up done. my mama's house. It, it had to be. I couldn't I couldn't think about doing nothing 
unless I did what I had to do around the house. Man, we didn't made it too, too much and we didn't spoil these children to the point where they don't even like understand what goes into it. And I'm, and I'm afraid that I cannot t- reverse this. That's what I'm afraid of. I can't reverse I need, this. I need, I need Tommy DeVito to say, you know what? I kind of didn't give all the details. I didn't give all the context when I said I live with my parents. I take care <laughs> of the landscaping. You're right. That's right. what I do. You're right. I'll I, wash, stuff. I wash my yeah. daddy's car every yeah. every Saturday. But you still got to make up morning, the bed. I watch there is it, nothing wax my it, children know that there, there is nothing that pisses me off more than an unmade bed. I'm like, I'm like, you think I was in the military when it comes to the bed. Like, don't walk out. Like, and why would you walk out of your room without making the bed? Why would you walk out? Like, just, you know what it is for me? You know what it is for me? It's dishes in the sink. Just dishes. Oh, my in the wife sink. hates that. If you Ooh. leave a fork in the sink, Sarah Ooh. goes crazy. But, What's but, going but, on okay, here? But, I, but I'm sure the same thing happens with you. Like. You ain't got no maid around here. You ain't got no butler around here. Like right. you just put it in the sink. What's up? Just leave it in the sink. Like who's supposed to clean that up? Who's supposed to clean that up? They always like they, they know my line. Dishwashers available. Hey, thank you for watching, brother from another. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead and do that now. Don't forget you can catch us three to four weekdays on PeacockTV.com and on SiriusXM channel 85.